I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down, yeah. No friends of mine, no friends of mine. Hi guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. <sighs> We're here. We made it. It's the video that everyone's been waiting for. Well, maybe not everyone, but at least some of you. Welcome to my first closet cleanup of 2023. If you guys have been watching my channel for a while, you guys know that I used to film these like all the time. One year, I literally cleaned out my closet three times because I just had that many clothes. But now it's 2023 and I haven't filmed one of these in a fat minute. So guess what we're doing this week? I've been trying to do this for so long. Like the past few months, I'm like, do a closet clean out, do a closet clean out, do a closet clean out. But I'm like, no, it's just gonna take me forever. But now I'm forcing myself to do it because I just can't put it off anymore. Longer. So I'm giving myself the next few days to go through all of my clothes. You guys are gonna help me declutter, organize, just make sure everything's tidy and clean because right now my room is stressing me out because there's just clothes everywhere. We're gonna go through my closet, which is my main one in my room, my dresser and my drawers, and then finally my jacket closet, which is in the hallway. So we have a lot to go through. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, so if you've watched past closet cleanouts, you guys know that usually my first step is to go through this closet and just take out any clothes that I haven't worn in a while. I forgot it was in my closet. And just clothes that I know another person could get a lot more use out of but actually my mom got a little head start for me she did it one day when I was at school so thank you Lindalina but as a result I have this huge pile of clothes on this bench this is horrendous like you can't even tell it's a bench anymore oh peep the trash bags I'm gonna put all of the clothes like I'm gonna sell and donate and stuff but I also have clothes that I just need to like put away and hang up I just haven't touched anything <laughs> because this pile of clothes scares me oh and then also here are all the hangers from those clothes. So we're off to a great start already. But I think right now I'm gonna go through my closet again and still go through everything and take some stuff out that I don't think I'll wear. Cause like I haven't even reviewed what my mom took out. So I'm gonna do that, add it to that pile of clothes and then go through all of that pile and see what I wanna keep, donate and sell. Oh, let's do it. So this closet, if you didn't know, just has all of my tops, long sleeves, short sleeves, not my tank tops, that's in a different place. And then also just like light jackets. Let's do this. My closet also makes that terrible noise. It's usually worse than that. I was just opening it slowly. But what I wanted to say was I actually color coded my closet. It's always been like that. Black, gray, brown, and white. And then on that side, which you guys will see in a minute, are all of my colors. I definitely want to keep it like that. And then also my hangers. It used to be all white, but then you see like there's a little blue in there. Ideally, I want to go back to like all white hangers. So I'm going to try to do that as well. Okay, let's go through the thing and see what I want to take out. I'm already having a hard time. <laughs> Here's my dilemma. A lot of these clothes, yes, I forgot it was in my closet, but then I'm seeing them and I'm like, oh, I could wear this to like an event. But then at the moment, like I don't have any events to go to. So then it's like, do I keep it just in case or do I just give it away? <sighs> I feel like I should just give it away. Cause then if I keep it, then I'll just be filming another closet clean out in like a year and be like, oh my God, I forgot about this. Okay, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Oh, by the way, I'm literally just throwing the clothes like on the ground and then putting the hangers like where. <laughs> Are these like too similar that I should give away one? Okay, but like this one like has a little more beige, I feel like. And I don't know. <laughs> Guys, help me. Someone help me. I don't know what to do. I've worn both of them like a good amount already. Okay, see this one has buttons. This one does not. What do I do? I'm gonna keep both. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Woo! I have loved this dress. I've loved it. But I think it's time to give it away. It's also like getting a little tiny. <sighs> I don't know if I'm making the right decisions, you guys. Moving to the next step. Who remembers this dress? If you know, you know. Oh my god. <laughs> Good thing I'm doing this because in two weeks, no, next week we have another class comp and I like bought this shirt specifically for class comp, but I forgot about it. But now I remembered. So <laughs> this is so cute though. Oh, anyways. Like, tell me why there's a white piece of clothing in the purple section. What is happening, Nicole? Oh man. Okay. 
so I went through it and I actually got oh someone's here but I actually went through a good amount of clothes and got some new hangers so that's great another problem I'm facing though is like spring and summer are also coming up so like I'm saving a bunch of clothes that I think I'm gonna wear for those seasons but again like I just don't know I feel like there's more I could take out but so far we just have that okay anyways I'm gonna add all those clothes to this pile now put things that I want to give away on the floor and then things that I need to put up like hang and stuff on my bed okay I think that's a good plan while I go through all this I'm gonna play some music um to keep me going a bench again okay guys that honestly didn't take that long like as long as i thought it would but again thank you to my mother because that helped me so much because i just know if it was in my closet still i would keep a lot of that but she knows she was like she's not gonna wear this but a lot of the clothes i'm giving myself the rest of winter to wear some and then if i don't then i should probably give it away but i'll deal with that later and then a lot of the other ones are for like spring and summer like i said so i'm hoping i wear that then and if not then by the next closet clean out i better be on just massive piles of clothes so we have all this on my bed which is to hang up put away and then this pile is all the stuff that i'm gonna donate sell and give away oh and also i'm literally like a full-on target right now look at how many hangers i have this is insane like what by the way the sun is going down if you couldn't tell so the lighting oh yikes the lighting's gonna be a little yellow but we're gonna keep going because the grind don't stop and my room is not gonna look like this for the rest of the day time to put all of this in a trash bag or multiple trash bags and then hang all of this up and also reorganize my closet make sure all of the hangers are white and make sure everything is color-coded let's go That took me a good 30 minutes and I'm so tired. Mm. As you can see, I put my hair up because I was getting hot and my head started hurting. But at least all my clothes are hung now. And I still have like a bunch of hangers left over, which is great. I'm gonna just take a little break though because my head still hurts. I do want to finish up with my closet for today, but I'll see you guys after my break. <laughs> All right, guys, I had some pho. I'm feeling good. <laughs> now we're gonna do the rest of my closet. So I don't think this portion will be too bad. Basically, I just have like a bunch of random stuff like on the bottoms of my closet. You guys will see and I'll explain like what I keep down there. But there's definitely a lot of stuff that I can give away and just not have there because I do not use it. Oh, and by the way, when I was sorting my clothes, obviously color-coded, like the order of my clothes in each color, <laughs> Guys are gonna think I'm crazy. My crew necks first, and then long sleeves, and short sleeves, and then dresses. So basically, like whatever has the most fabric is over here, and then it goes like less fabric. If that even makes sense, I don't even know. Okay, but anyways, on the bottom on this side, I have a bunch of clothes. <laughs> what a surprise! Basically, it's literally just a bunch of pants, multiple pairs of jeans. We'll go through these when I do my dresser. But for now, they're just like sitting here. I'm gonna have to put them on the chair. I'm sorry, the bench is just the bench, you know? Everyone has a place in the room where they throw all their clothes. For me, it's my bench. Ugh, I'm gonna go through these later. Oh, and hopefully I can find a place for them. But yeah, it's like stuff that some brands have sent me, jeans that I bought on my own. I just don't have room in my drawer, so I just put them in my closet. Okay, but yeah. Ugh. I also have these pairs of slippers. Got them from BS. But I use these every single day, so these are just some of my backup. I'm gonna keep them there. These three drawers have clothes in them, but like I never go in these drawers. Oh my gosh, I just broke it. Well, that's great. These are from Target. I've had them for a while, like years. But basically, I have like workout clothes in here. Gymshark sent me some clothes like a while back, so a lot of these don't fit me anymore. But some do. Keep this. These are too small. I think this still fits. Oh, this is cute. Very nice. Okay, but like this sports bra, way too tight. So are these leggings. So like besides that, it's just like these sets and they're super cute. So I'm gonna keep them. Hopefully this will inspire me to like go to the gym because I don't know about you guys, but like if I have a cute outfit on like with gym clothes, then I'm like, oh yeah, I'm gonna work out. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. See, like I didn't even know, I forgot that I had this adorable. So I'm gonna give some away and then also keep some and hopefully I wear it in the next few months. <laughs> Now that I took stuff out, I can finally like easily open this drawer because it's not overfilled now. <laughs> this next drawer are more workout clothes. Oh my gosh, I forgot about all this. This is stuff I got in like middle school, I think. 
clothes. I've had this for a long time. I'm gonna give some stuff away because I don't wear like these types of clothes to the gym. Okay, but this is cute. Oh, these are adorable. I'm gonna keep them. Oh my gosh, a leotard. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna keep all this. And this last door is literally the most randomest thing ever. I have another ballet leotard. Some tights that I haven't even opened. Like, why? These sets from Adidas. Again, I got these in middle school. I'm not gonna wear this. Well, I mean, I guess I have, like, more space now in those drawers. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with them. But, yeah. Oh, my God! Holy, Holy cow! Mom, say hi. Hi. I don't know why that's scary. Do you want me to so wash your sheets? Tomorrow. Maybe okay. Tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Bye. <gasps> oh, that was terrifying. <laughs> wow. Okay. Like I was saying, I have another set of these three drawers right here. This has some books that don't fit on my shelves over there. And then, <laughs> y'all are gonna laugh. I've gotten a few questions to like show my case by collection. Here you go. This drawer is full of my case by cases. And just like extra electronic stuff. I have like Canon picture paper, screen protectors, and whatnot. So I'm gonna keep all this too. This last drawer has more electronic stuff. Like, look, I have my old Fuji film camera. The most randomest things, like this is a label maker. I have extra whiteout that I got from Amazon. Okay, you know what? These are not my clothes. So I'm just not gonna go through this right now. <laughs> I don't have the energy to. Basically a little rundown, some extra bags, like backpacks, a box of camera stuff, and then hats. I also have my tote bag. <laughs> and when my mom was like going through my clothes, she put all my socks in here, like my fuzzy socks. I'm done. <laughs> Last thing I'm gonna do for today is just put this in another trash bag and I will see you guys the next day Then I'm working on all my clothes. Peace out. Hello guys, I'm back. It's actually a few days later. Today's actually Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> but now it's time to tackle these drawers right here and then my dresser. Look, I can't even close that drawer because it's just overfilled. Um, but we have a lot more work to do, so let's get started. So, in these drawers, this top drawer, I keep all of my Lululemon stuff and then these two are just a bunch of tank tops. I think they're from Dormify, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, I got them a few years ago, but I decided to put all my tank tops in here instead of my closet Which was such a good idea because like tank tops are tiny So like putting them on a hanger and then in my closet, they were just taking up too much space So it was good that I moved them in here, but as you can see <laughs> I also can't close it. I just have too many so we're gonna go through them But let's do my Lululemon drawer first I feel like I wear a lot of these already because I just love Lulu But I'm trying to keep the mindset if I haven't worn it and I know I'm not gonna wear it Discard it. Not discard it. Give it away, sell it. You know, you know the deal. Okay, let's go through this drawer. I just did two pals, things I'm gonna keep and then things I'm gonna give away over here. My main priority though is to like make sure each drawer is organized because my drawers used to be so organized. Now I kind of just like throw things in there and I literally like can't find anything. Oh, that's another thing. With these drawers, I usually just wear like what's at the top because I don't want to dig what's at the bottom. So then like all the stuff at the bottom, I haven't worn in so long, but like I should. I just don't because I'm too lazy to go down there. So I need to organize them to make sure I'm getting full usage out of the clothes that I keep. Let me organize my loot. Love you, okay? Love you more, mama. Bye bye. Call me if you need anything. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. So, oh. <laughs> So much better so this side I put like leggings and shorts and then the side are like tank tops and long sleeves some of my stuff are still in the laundry though so I have like more room to add which is perfect moving on to my tank tops basically the way I had it was this one has all of like my neutral colors so black white tan brown go in here and then all of my colored go in here I also used to roll all of my tank tops and like stack them and it looks so organized but obviously it's not like that anymore so let's do the same process just take everything out sort through them and then organize Oh, my back hurts so bad. <laughs> but you guys, we have made such good progress. This is feeling so good. Like, yes, closet cleanouts are like so tiring, but I forgot like the feeling of satisfactory after. You just feel like refreshed and clean. Okay, but anyways, these are my colored tank tops. I have like pink and blue, and then under are like other colors. But oh my gosh. I literally took out so much, which is great. Now I finally have space to close the drawers <laughs> and I can actually look through the drawers. All right, complete. <laughs> Oh, 
now we're at my dresser. <laughs> Honestly, I've been dreading kind of this part the most. My closet, yes, was very tiring. But like this, we need a lot of organizing to do. Thankfully, those drawers though weren't that bad. So I'm hoping it's kind of like that. But basically, these top four are like undergarments. And I already went through that. So that's out of the way. But we have like all of my pants and stuff. So this drawer has all of my shorts, leggings, and just other stuff that I threw in there. These are my jeans. These are my sweatpants. And then these are all my PJs and like t-shirts. I think I want to start with this drawer first. Let me just show y'all. As you can see, it's not that organized. I've kind of just like stacked a bunch of stuff. But before, when it was organized, I have like shorts here, skirts in the back, and some leggings on this side. But there's definitely stuff I can take out, so. Can someone tell me why there's a pair of socks in here? Hmm. See, like, what is even happening? For sure, I wanted to donate my brandy skirts because I got these in, like, middle school and they definitely don't fit me anymore. And I had a lot. Like, your girl was obsessed with brandy. So I'm gonna give... Oh. Hi. Hey. Can I brush some tape? Sure. What are you doing? I'm rushing because I fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get ready for my Valentine's Day. Oh, wow. My anniversary day. Oh, wow. Have fun. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Uh -huh. But like I was saying, I'm gonna give away all my brandy stuff. I also have, like, lounge shorts in here. Okay, so I just went through what I want to give away, and I think I'm going to do the same organization. Like, skirts in the back, because for some reason, I don't know, I have a lot of skirts. And then shorts, pants, and leggings, so let's try. You guys so much better. Ugh, that's just giving me so much joy. I also used to keep my gym shorts that I got from Amazon. These are my favorite. I put them in here as well, but I think I'm gonna move them to the drawers in my closet, like at the bottom, because I had more space in there, so I'm just gonna keep all of those in there. Now moving on to my pajamas. I don't know why there's just so much in this drawer. Basically, to sleep, I just wear either like pajama shorts or pajama pants and then like a big t-shirt. So I keep all my t-shirts in here, but I haven't organized them in literally so long, so they're just like stuffed in here. All right, let's get to it. just like what the heck i'm deciding to take everything out then i can go through it see what i don't need anymore and then sort and then organize that's been my process and it's been working really well and then same thing i'm gonna roll all the shirts and put them on this side probably and then my pants on this side I am overjoyed. Look at this. It's amazing. Like I said, I just rolled all my t-shirts on this side. There's two layers and then two layers over here as well. So I call my PJ pants and yeah, it's just great. Oh my God. <coughs> Not gonna lie, I am starting to get tired, but we're gonna push through. Now moving on to these two. So these are all my jeans and like literally, little wee, little wee. Every time I try to put some stuff in there, it's just like always overfilling. So I'm trying to figure out a new way that I could organize them. I'm gonna try rolling them. But I don't know how well that works with jeans, but I'm gonna take all of them out and like go through them. I also have some pants on my bench that you guys saw earlier, and I also have to add them into this drawer. Ugh. Jeans are so heavy. It just keeps going. Okay, we're good. I'm also gonna get the ones over there. Uh, someone help. <laughs> uh. Okay, let's begin. Okay, so the rolling technique is definitely not going to work with my jeans, but I think I've decided instead of putting my jeans in this drawer, I'm going to try to put them all in this one because as you can see, this one's a little bigger than that. Right now, I have all of my sweatpants in here, but I feel like I can minimize them and put them in that drawer. So I'm going to do a little switcheroo and hopefully all of that fits in there. Success! Last thing of my sweatpants, I'm going to go through them real quick and then I'll be done with my dresser. five trash bags down and finally we have my jackie closet we're almost there guys okay so if you didn't know here's the closet 
basically this is the closet like when you walk up the stairs and then it's here and then there's a few more stairs i didn't have space in my room for my jackets so we put them here we also use this closet for storage so like up there and then down there are just like a bunch of random things i might go through that with my mom like a different day but in this video i'm gonna tackle all of my jackets so let me just show you how messy it is this closet also used to be all white hangers but as you can see we have some color in there they also used to be color coded and it's obviously not like that. Look at this. That is not okay. I don't really know how I want to organize this as well. Actually, before, I don't even know if it was color-coded, but I did have my hoodies on one side and then, like, my other puffers and, like, jean jackets on this side. So I think I want to try to do that again. But right now, it's just a freaking mess. So let's do it. <laughs> Those are stuff I want to give away. And then those clothes, they should be in my main closet. I don't know how they ended up in there, but I'm going to move them over there. Problem is, it's still very packed in here. I'm hoping when I organize it, maybe it won't look as like stressful. I don't know. Let's try to organize hoodies on this side and then the rest on this side. This is crazy. It looks so much better. So color coded all of my hoodies. And then on this side, I have like jean jackets, puffers, or sorry, fluffy stuff, puffers, letterman jackets, and then miscellaneous in the back. But I also fixed the hangers and it just looks so much better, you guys. Mm, I'm just so happy. Okay, last thing. Gonna put this in the trash bag and then we'll be done. Are you guys? I am done. We go still on the best side. so symphony. Souls connect so physically. Yeah. shine like laser beams. Wanna feel your energy. Yeah. I'm giving you songs. Your voice lead into and that is going to be it for today's video that concludes my first clean out of 2023 i am so glad that is over and i'm so glad that i finished all of it hopefully this gives you a little motivation to clean your room maybe clean out your own closet as well but trust me it feels so good in the end my closets have been so cluttered for so long and i'm just very happy that i got through all of that but i will be posting a lot of my clothes on my poshmark so if you guys would like to shop my closet my username is at nicole underscore leno i'm gonna try to post all of these clothes up on there within the next few weeks so definitely check that out and i'll like keep you guys updated every time i post listings but yeah that is it from me if you guys stay till the end of this video comment down below with the dress emoji and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed make sure to like and comment down below subscribe to my channel turn on post notifications and go cops and clothing merch i'll see you guys back with another video i love you guys so so much stay positive bye down yeah i've been feeling so i've been feeling so down yeah can you tell me why can you tell me why i'm down yeah no friends of mine, no friends of mine around